Oh, teacher, so sorry. So no sorry. problem. <laughs> I feel shame right now. No, don't worry. Don't worry. Everything is okay. This, uh, okay. well, you know, things happen. Things happen. And with the internet, we, uh, we can't predict. Okay. Yeah, yeah. It's not normal here, but right now, <laughs> I don't know what happened. Something. But, okay, okay. Yeah. Okay. Really, uh, what, um, we were talking about your activities. Um, oh, yes. And your job yeah, sure. and your, and your um, courses. Sure. Yeah, I, I was talking about it. Okay. And right now, another, another thing. I think just that because I'm in the in the English English word, you know okay. English word. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right now because I I wanna travel and I wanna learn a lot. Okay. Can you give me an uh, advice mm -hmm. if I wanna learn a lot English? Because right now I'm I'm uh, read a book. Yeah, read a book and um um Okay, I am reading watching, a book. I yeah. am reading a book, uh-huh. And I am watching some uh, movies or videos in English and excellent. Excellent. And music and talk with gringos and you were class. doing you were doing everything that uh we yeah, but, ask students to do. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but uh, but I need an, an uh, advice. Do you Some have advice. Some advice for me? Okay. Uh, how to learn or how to improve your English? How? What, how what to improve? Mean? How that? Uh, I don't know. How to improve what? means it's like uh, a... como mejorar, right? How to improve. How to improve. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. I. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Yeah, sure. First, you have to focus or you have to uh, determine what is sure. the. Yeah, tell me. No, no, no. Oh, just, okay. uh, just internet poll. Oh, okay. Uh, first, you have to determine what is your, I mean, your. Uh, your difficulty, right? Uh, what is more sure. difficult for you? Because if it is easy for you to understand when someone's speaking, okay, uh, we have to focus in the things that um, are you are struggling with, okay? Yeah. For example, I, I don't know. I don't know what's the, the skill that you need to improve. I, I really don't know. Because in speaking, I see that you are not ashamed, right? You yeah. are not ashamed. You just do it, and uh, and it's and you do it very well. You do it very well. I could Thank say you. Uh, that you are doing a good job, and you're improving. Your personal improving, and um, I think you have to determine what is the skill that you you are struggling with. Okay, if it okay. is about vocabulary. You have limited vocabulary, then you have to expand your vocabulary. How do you do that? Uh, for example, thinking about the things around you or the things that you usually have in hand, okay, have next okay. to you. Uh, you extend your vocabulary thinking um, on English, thinking on English about these things. For example, the activities that you do in your job, the activities that you do in some places. For example, if you go out with your friends, think about the things around you and the activities that you do with them, okay? Thinking every activity in English, like by topics, right? By topics. Uh, for example, things that you do in a swimming pool, right? Things that you do on the beach, things that you do, if that's extending your vocabulary. And then, okay, if you want to, um, if you want to speak uh, more fluently, more fluently, even though you speak fluently, because you have that, um, it's easy for you to do it. I feel it, right? I feel it. Uh, but if you want to improve the speaking, 
in this case that you have the, uh, we could say ability, okay? You have the ability to speak, then you have to improve your grammar, okay? You have to improve your grammar because now you know how to say some things maybe spread all around, right? Spread all. But if you want to structure, structure um, a, um, sentences, expressions, and reading is a very good activity to do to do that. Okay, grammar, grammar, structures, structures, how to say something, but in order, in order in the correct order of the words, right? Because the order usually gives the meaning of the expression. Maybe if you change the order of the words, then it means something completely different, right? So if you learn grammar by reading, you are doing a good thing, okay? You are improving, improving that part. If it is about listening, if it is about listening, there is nothing else to do more than listen to, right? More than listen to. You can go over the internet and look for exercises, uh, listening exercises, uh, grammar listening exercises, speaking listening exercises, you know, everything that is related with listening or uh, watching the news, for example watching the news in the American channels and the uh, British channels, Australian channels, uh, you improve your daily, daily um, speaking and daily listening, right? Daily, it, it will be everyday English, right? Everyday English. If you watch the news, for example, if you watch programs like uh, como lo de nosotros viva la mañana, but in English, right? You you can, uh, if you watch those kind of shows, it will be giving you some more expressions and idioms, right? Idioms to um, be more com comfortable when you speak with native people, right? With native people, because with native people is different than if you speak with uh, people who speaks two or three languages, right? So it's completely different. They understand anyway, but native people, maybe they are gonna say, I'm sorry, what did you say? What do you wanna say, right? So yes, I think watching shows, but in the in the daily uh, life, like Viva La Mañana, like those kind of, uh, right now I don't have in my mind some, uh, yeah, Friday, uh, it is uh, Saturday Night Live, right? Saturday Night Live is a very good uh, thing. You can watch also these shows of these comedians in English, right? The, it, it's a funny activity and also you are learning. English, okay? Uh, these comedians are really funny and well, you improve. You improve your listening and you improve your vocabulary, right? So it, there are a lot of activities that you can do. There are a lot of activities, but you have to focus what's your main uh, or activity that you're skill that you are struggling with, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's perfect because uh, right now uh, I I, ha I have a lot of vocabulary, but it's a scramble. You know, mm -hmm. it's like a scramble. It's yeah. um, I have the words, but when I I I'm going to do the when I I go I don't know when when, when you I want to structure to, when you want to yeah, structure to sure. express something. Of course, this is so hard and. Mm -hmm. Then if I if I don't uh, I don't do I don't know what is the correct form or what's the correct sentence I feel like uh, oh Jesus man mm -hmm. but don't I worry like, uh, but don't worry everybody goes through that okay everybody yeah, goes through that so don't worry and if you have uh, a doubt or maybe you don't know how to say something. Don't be afraid to ask, 
Don't be afraid to okay. ask and tell the people or the person that you were talking to, I'm sorry, but my vocabulary is still limited. Could you please tell me what do you want to say? Can you show me in a different way? Okay, don't worry. You, you can do that. It's valid. Okay, it's okay. valid. Mm -hmm. And then you learn more, right? Sure, sure, of course. Uh, mm -hmm. I remember in the last time when um, I feel so bad because I said, uh, more good, you know, in Spanish is uh, like, oh. it's good. You said more good, you know? And I said to my guest, I was surfing with my guest and I said, here is more good. And he said, oh, Renette, don't say that. Just said better. Mm -hmm. and, and I feel so bad because this is it's like my it's my <laughs> big big mistake uh, don't worry <laughs> my life this is, is what yeah. oh no Jesus yeah some experience yeah, to learn yeah is... <laughs> maybe uh, well, sure okay <laughs> well course. yeah but that's the way to learn that's a, a very good way to learn too even though it's kind of uh, embarrassing. Yeah. Of course it is. <laughs> it's so weird. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay, but weird. no problem. I see that we took more than five minutes. Uh, so <laughs> thank you for reconnecting. Yeah. And uh, well, if there no. is, okay. Thank you. Thank you to you for, for waiting for me, you know. Okay, no problem. Thank you for waiting no for problem. me. No problem. And I was waiting for you, and then I made a sure. mistake. I made a mistake, and I clicked on uh, this other button here. And then I realized, oh, my God, and it was converting the, the video. Oh, my God, come on. Then I, yeah. Reopened, yeah, I reopened a new, a, new, a new meeting. Okay, perfect. Then thank you so much, teacher. No you are a good teacher. And... <sighs> Okay, I will be work so hard in my English. It's okay, okay. right? Yeah, I, I will be working. Okay, I will be working so hard or heavy? No, hard, hard. I will be working so hard, hard. in my English and later, maybe in future, um, I will be your co-worker. Excellent. Excellent. You should you you be my guest. Be my guest. Yes. We wait for you over here teaching English to others. Okay, good. <laughs> That's a good desire. Okay, then Rene, have a good night. Have a good rest. Okay. Have a have a good night too. And I have some problems right now in my internet. So sorry for that. Oh, okay, no problem. No problem. Okay, have a good night, teacher, and thank you so much for all. Okay, no problem. Bye bye. Absolutely, I will be uh, waiting for your class. The tomorrow class, right? Yes, great. Perfect. Have a good night. Have a good night too. Bye. Bye. <laughs>